All right, dark side cookies, here you go. I set it up the best I could, and this shows a bad number setup, but watch what happened, because this gentleman starts dropping gift of heavens on all of the mages and all the troops. Otherwise, as I was watching the battle, the crossbows were actually punching through the knights pretty well, even with the arrow fend up. I'll give you a shot and show you what I saw. It wasn't as dominating as before, certainly, but as you can see, in the beginning of the battle, they seem to be doing pretty well. You can see all the little poison ticks going. And then as soon as I see Gift of Heavens drop, I'll pause it and I'll show you how many have died just to arrow fire. Look at this, getting all poisoned and tapped. So you see, you can see they're taking damage, they're getting knocked out, getting hurt, but the poison's really slow. Lighting a few on fire. But you can see all the poison ticks everywhere. That means they're punching through the protection. You see this, all these little damage markers indicate they're getting quite a bit of damage through. It's not a slaughter with Arrowfend, obviously, when you're taking away four out of five missiles, but it sure seems to be still effective, and they're holding up pretty well. And right there's the first Gift of Heaven, Gifts from Heaven, so I'll show you. When we go through here, the majority of the plate infantry are still good. Majority of the crossbows just exploded, but look at all the horses that have died all the mounts that have died so far just from crossbows. And then the knights are starting to die a little bit. A little bit. You can see, look at their HP bars here. They're getting trashed by the poison, the fire, and the archery fire. I really still think they're holding up, to be honest with you. And this is obviously a whole bunch of crossbows. Crossbows have, as you said, always been really powerful once you get a, you know, critical mass. I mean, that's been something we've all known for a long time. Even with Arrowfend being nerfed, and then let's say you do get to it and get Arrowfend up, it sure seems like it's still holding up pretty well. So I'll link this in my description on the other video, but I wanted to put this video up for you real quick so you could see. These guys are actually still punching right through the mounts specifically, and the mounts are no slouches. They still go up, I think it was 29 or something. Let me check. 31 still, 31, 32, even better on the Destria. And they're still getting punched out. I just think because the horses have a larger space on the square, that's why the crossbow men are more likely to hit them because obviously there's five size versus the three size in the same square, so they have a higher likelihood of being hit. And as you can see, they're dying from it. They're dying and getting slaughtered by it. I mean, that's a good majority of them. So it looks like these knights are still getting plinked apart. Now, it's not nearly as fast as before, which we kind of expected from the arrow fend, but... Even with Arrowfend 31-32-ish protection, these crossbows are still proven to be a big force. Hope that helped.